a bakery of any sort, his first thing's like, can we get donuts? Mm. <laughs> you would live on donuts. He's just like, oh, I should really stop eating so many sweets and sugary foods. Like maybe just for like the month of February, I will cut out sweets. I'd have a six pack if I didn't eat <laughs> sweets. Probably. It's your mom, your mom did it for you guys. Yeah. Living with four, what, five men. His, Kyle has nothing but brother. His mom would always have food going, always have food in the fridge. Always have the dessert. <laughs> always having dessert and baked goods, brownies, cookies, anything. We're yeah. all turned out skinny. Skinny boys. <laughs> hey, you better be careful though. I might catch up yeah. with you. But yeah, so we went to Green Dragon and we got some pretzels because the pretzels are so good there. Pretzels are good. <laughs> Um, but yeah, anyways, we were headed to my sister's house just to hang out there for a little bit. Go ahead, do an ASMR for food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, food review from Green Dragon. Peanut butter long gun. It's pretty good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. 7.5 out of 10. The dough, it's a little hard. I'd still take another bite though. I will just eat his donut in the background. <laughs> <laughs> got home a little bit ago. It is around 6.15 right now, so I'm going to go ahead and make dinner. Um, we're just going to do super simple Friday night dinner. Just uh, put some fries in the air fryer. Barbecue carnitas. Chicken, some peppers, Cajun seasoning. Okay, I need to stop talking so I can go ahead and make dinner. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and fill you guys in real quick on what's been going on. So I woke up late, first of all. I woke up super late. I didn't wanna get out of bed that late. It was probably around 9.45 till I got out of bed. Went to the gym and then my dad called me and he wanted to meet me for lunch. So it was nice to catch up with him. Now I'm currently at my sister's house, about to go inside. We are gonna go to the mall and get her ears pierced, which I don't know what that is about like that's so exciting like oh we're gonna get our ears pierced i'm not gonna get my ears pierced i don't think because the only thing i would consider getting is probably my cartilage up there which i have done that twice and each time it is absolutely terrible it gets infected it gets really gross and then it ends up closing and it's just like this whole thing and not to mention like i've done it twice so i like i've wasted money each time i just don't want to go through it again so i'm mainly there just for support i think we might go to the tj maxx by the mall i want to go before all the things are like all the good things are gone and like sorted through and picked through and everything so be home this evening to like hang out with him make dinner probably and just spend time with him before he goes back in tomorrow morning at 3 a.m but yeah i'm just gonna go inside and we will get going i'll show you guys my little outfit for the day because i didn't really have a chance to show you guys earlier yeah this is kind of i think they're home <laughs> <laughs> She's so excited. Did we go to the mall today? <laughs> How does she do that? She like looks, she like puts her legs straight. <laughs> I'm really nervous. What's gonna happen to mommy? I should hold mommy's hand. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hey, 
Thank you. <laughs> Thank you too. Yeah, they look good. Yeah. Yeah. Are you sure? Did you? When you looked in the mirror, did you? I like did. It? Papa, what? This doesn't look. Okay. Twenty-five dollars. We smell really good. Yeah, it's you. <laughs> Just got home a little bit ago. It is currently around seven o'clock at night. I'm just gonna go ahead and take my makeup off for the evening, which is the best part of the day. Um, so I'll probably just go downstairs, eat leftovers, and then watch a movie or maybe just watch our show right now, which we are currently watching Big Bang Theory. It's really hard for us to agree on a movie, let alone a show, because we just have both different personalities in shows and movies. So this is one that we like kind of agreed on. I will probably see you guys in the morning. I don't really know. I know I'm going to go to church, but I don't know which church I'm going to. Kyle won't be with me, so I was thinking about just going to one of my sister's churches tomorrow. I'm gonna go to TJ Maxx where I am in Lebanon and look at the one here and I hope that they have Valentine's Day stuff. I'm just gonna go downstairs and hang out with Kyle. This is my outfit. I absolutely love it. It's just like a go-to staple, nice, elegant outfit, I think. Just a long trench coat. I got it from Ardeen, which is just a store here at our local mall. Long sleeve turtleneck dress, sheer leggings, and then these boots, which I got from either H&M or Forever 21. I got them a while back, probably. Good morning, sister. <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> I want to go ahead and show you guys what I got Friday at Fashion Sense. This huge, gigantic pillow. It is originally from Target. It's the Threshold brand. Originally, this pillow is like $40, I mean, $40, $50, whatever. I will not pay that for a pillow. I just think it's ridiculous, especially knowing that I got this for $10. Absolutely. A Valentine's Day plate. I think I might put like some cute like cookies and stuff on there, whether I do that with my sister's Wednesday or Kyle and I do something here at the house. Which I need some good black sweatpants. So I just got these and then just some few workout shirts because I have been loving nothing cropped or really like skin tight really. So I've been really liking like loose shirts. So I got this long sleeve one, which is just black. It's from Old Navy, their active collection. Got like the short version, which I think it is literally just the short t-shirt version. It's the same brand, Old Navy Active. Tissue paper because I plan on gifting Valentine's Day. Gifts to my two sisters and then Kyle's mom. Little heart-shaped car, which I think is from Target. So I got these like little dangly ones, hoops, and then just like studs of some sort. A gold necklace with some um, studs on it. So that's my little haul from Friday. Right now, I am just going to eat some lunch, and then after I eat lunch, I'm gonna get ready and go for a run at the park. Thank you. Day. Yeah, you too, man. Which one do you like more? The brown one. This one's so pretty, though. Nope, I like that one. <gasps> Why? Because it's cheaper. <laughs> it's a rinky dink stand. It's $25. So I am currently on a mission to 
try and get Kyle to get one of these because he puts like his deodorant, his hair gel, his cologne, his toothbrush and everything in a plastic Walmart bag. And so I'm gonna try and talk him into it. How much you wanna bet that he's gonna say no to these? What about these? I don't need one. Yes, babe. A yes, you do. Bag is fine. No. Why don't I need You're an adult. Life, You're an adult. You should does just it make get... me a kid? Yes, it does. This is not necessary, though. It is necessary, babe. You cannot just transport a Walmart plastic bag with you. That's like ripped apart. I've been doing that for three years since we've been married. We just got home. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what we got. Starting off, I just got these pimple patches. They were like $3.99. Both my sisters use these, so I got two of these. And they're like in a cute color, so I thought that'd be perfect for Valentine's Day to put it inside there. Lavender candle. And it took a little convincing, but I am so happy that he got one. So we opted for this one, but it's a weatherproof one, so that's really nice. And I don't really... It's just like a vintage little design part of the bag. So I want to put a picture in here for them and put them in their Valentine's Day gifts. Wood frame with a gold outer trim and inner trim. I have a bible study today at 6 30 and then kyle has a basketball game tonight so we'll probably see you guys at the basketball game <laughs> oh, this game is killing me there's a little under four minutes left and it's 66 67 and the other team's up by one oh, i really want them to win they've been playing so hard Whoa! 